and welcome to the Fast Reports Academy. In this video, I will demonstrate how to install Fast Report VCL or upgrade it to a later version. Firstly, I'll show how to install the trial version and then the full version from the customer panel. To skip to the installation of the full version, proceed to this timecode. So, if you would like to try out Fast Report VCL before the purchase, you can go to this section of our website. You can find a link to it in the description. There are several packages that you can try out, but if you want to try out the report designer and the report engine in general in the quickest way, you can download the compiled demo. Click on this entry, fill out the form if it gets offered to you, and you will receive the file. And when it's downloaded, open it and proceed throughout the installer steps. Accept the terms of the license agreement. You can read about the new features if you'd like to. Then specify the installation location. Choose one of the start menu hyperlink options. And after that, the installation can finish. You can open the demo right after the installation. And after that, you can browse the various reports that are supplied within the trial version of FastReport VCL. And now I'll show the installation of the full version of FastReport VCL. To install it, you need to access your customer panel on our website. You can access it by this link, and again you can find it in the description. The customer panel will have a list of products you own. If you can't find a product, check your profile and make sure it's not hidden. So as you can see, there are two important parts of the product card. The download section and the section with your license key. So, download the version you'd like to install, either the stable version or the current one, which includes all the recent changes. And copy your license key with this convenient button. But before opening the installer, there's an important step you should take if you've installed FastReport VCL before. Uninstalling the old version. Find the Uninstall FastReport VCL hyperlink in your start menu and open it. Choose the Uninstall option in the list and go through the installer steps. And, an important detail, after FastReport VCL is deleted, check the following folders for FastReport-related BPL files. After a successful uninstall, these files should be missing. But just in case something goes wrong, make sure they are deleted. While we were uninstalling the previous version, the installer of the new one has been downloaded. And let's proceed with the installation. Accept the license agreement. Read the technical description of FastReport VCL. Paste your license key. Choose the components of the install, if you'd like to. At this point you can disable the installation of the corresponding FastReport chart and IBX components. If you don't want to install the T-Chart STD and IBX component packages in your IDE. Choose the installation path and the start menu shortcut accessibility. And after that, the installation can begin. After the installation, you should run the Recompile wizard. And in it, you can configure your installation of FastReport VCL. The most important option is compiling the FastReport libraries for Delphi version that you need. And after you do that, everything is installed and configured. This was today's lesson on FastReport VCL. If you have any questions or suggestions, leave them in the comments. And be sure to check out other videos on the channel, in which we demonstrate FastReport VCL and our other products in detail. You can find all the playlists in the description.